Ultimate Fighter Simulator added their Hunter Hunter update. I am so excited to check this out. There's new bug fixes. There's new more things, better things, new more things, better. Somebody start the intro, okay? I'm stuttering. What's going on, everybody? It's Chris Blaze with the Resident Channel. I hope you have a fantastic day if you're not. You are about to because today we check out the Chimera Island Update 5 Anime Fighter Simulator. Guys, this is Hunter x Hunter based. I'm so excited because I've actually seen that show and I know about it. I, I will say though, people are going to be mad, but I haven't seen the Chimera Ant arc. I haven't seen the final arc in the series. There, There's like a bunch of episodes that go up to like episode 72 and then like from 72 to like 150 i haven't seen the second half of the show basically so please don't be mad at me if i don't recognize some of these characters i know going i know Killua. okay so we're, we're gonna do this but with that being said i am excited because we are gonna get 11 new fighters i'm gonna do whatever it takes to get oh and the level caps 110 and then all of these other fixes which is huge but the best part is i am going to get myself the. why do i look like that <laughs> I am going to get myself the mythical today. It's going to happen, I really hope, because I got two of them last time, these white reapers. Now we're heading over to Chimera Island and we're gonna get them. If you guys are hyped, then smash that like button. This game has 100,000 playing right now. That is actually insane. So I think we need 100,000 likes. Let's, let's just get 10% of that. 10, let's just get 10,000 likes. You, you guys down? I think we can do that. So smash that like button. Also, if you guys haven't already, make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell to never miss a video. I post two videos every single day. I just went on vacation. I had six videos pre-recorded, and I do want to say I am back now. And I want to mention something real quick. I'm not going to go into this too much because I know a lot of you guys are here to watch the Anime Fighter simulation, but I did upload two Tapping Gods videos that are kind of awkward now because basically the rewrite was supposed to come out, then there was supposed to be a 24 hour countdown, and then there was supposed to be a live event. Well, I made videos on those in my test server because that was before it was actually... Oh, wait, what is this? Oh, that's just the portal to the next world. I thought that was like a time trial. Oh, and there's quests. Cool. So there's different quests that you can... uh except so i could like take out these forces and then i'll get some stuff from completing the quest so that is actually really cool that they have it but anyways um tapping gods i know it's awkward i know that the update didn't come out the rewrite didn't come out all i can say is i'm sorry there's no one to blame i'm not trying to pin the blame on anyone i'm just saying at the end of the day there's not much i can do as the owner of the game i can just hope that the game gets done and works and if it doesn't work then the developers we just have to go back and fix it um, so that's all I can really do at this point. All I can do is reassure you guys that it will be completed at some point. The rewrite, it will be out. Um, the live event thing will still happen. We'll still make all of this stuff happen. I just don't know when, um, but let's just not rush it. Let's, I, I know we keep trying to say certain dates and stuff, and I never say these dates like too early. I never, I'm never like, okay, I really think we can go this Friday. Let me just say this Friday and hype it up. Like, I'm saying it when, like, we're playing the update in the server, the test server, and it's, like, officially done. Like, like as far as we're concerned, it's, like, done, 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 working, working, working. And then we release it, and just weird things go wrong. So, that's all I wanted to apologize for. I'm sorry. Um, sorry to everybody that got, you know, their hopes up. Sorry to the developers that got stressed out. We will figure this out. We'll make it right, and it'll come out. Don't worry. But that's not what we're here for. We're here to go to Chimera Island. I am so excited because I love Hunter x Hunter. It's a show about Gon hunting his dad. He's the hunter hunter. He's hunting a hunter. Such a cool idea. Um, there's also a ghoul quest. There's a quest for every single area. And there's also a new Robux star. So before we go to the next area, let's go here. There is a new star at Orange Line, I believe, right? Yeah, here it is, the Yonko star. So this is a new Robux egg, a Robux star, I should say. And you can get some sick stuff, including that special guy. I've never seen One Piece, I believe. Um, pretty sure this is based off One Piece, and I've never seen it, so don't judge me. Um, if you guys got the mythical and the new egg, let me know, or the new star. Let me know in the comment section below. That's what I'm aiming to get. I could get this 5%, but it's just, oh, the 10%. Let me try one more. Just one more. I gotta walk away. Oh! Oh my gosh! I was like, let me try one more and I got it. Well, then I might as well go for the other 25. I might as well go for the 25%, right? I mean, that's pretty easy. Right? Right? Please? Okay, this is awkward. I'm not actually getting it. What's happening here? Are we gonna get this thing? What's going on here? What's going on here? Okay, you know what? We'll leave it for now. We'll come back. 
but we got the best one, which is all I really care about. Now we have to make our way to the next area, which I'm assuming is gonna cost a lot of yen. So I'm a little bit worried, 500 million yen. Now having these characters is really, really OP, but they're still not that good. The Pirate King, oh, look, big man right here. 4.5K, if I fused him, he'd be really, really good. Let me try that actually. Let me fuse him with a lot of these Sukazas. Because I feel like if I level him up like a really high level, he might be better than these ghouls, but I don't actually know. Let me know the best character you guys have and any advice on how to get things faster because I'm kind of a noob at this game. All right, what do we got for big man? 230K! Dang, not bad at all. So he's really, really good. Let's go ahead and take off these pirate kings. They are just not very good. But this big man though, he's good. I'm wondering if this pirate king will be really good if we um upgraded him, but probably not better than like a Kenji upgraded you know what i mean so for now i'm just gonna have these three on but if i do have to equip two more i'll probably get i'll probably do it by this and then i'll get uh kenji i'll take this one off wait yeah i'll take this one off and we'll put this one on okay not a bad team not a bad team. look at big man he's actually huge he's actually massive that's insane all right so i'm just trying to make it to chimera island if i buy yen i have to do this twice if I fight, here's the thing. If I'm fighting, this is going to take a while, and I don't think I'm going to get that much yen. I will check out if there's any boost that I have. So looking here, extra damage, I need to open 10k stars. So we're almost there. We'll get the extra damage pretty soon. What about the um, yen earned? Collect the secret village badge. How do we get that? How do we get the secret village badge? Collect the Numek badge. How do we get that? Is that from just getting all the characters? Collect the secret village badge. Maybe it's from just getting all of the characters. So I might have to go back and try to unlock all of those characters. Oh, and there's mounts? Dude, that's so cool. I don't have any mounts yet. And there's badges. So I wish it told you how to get the badges, but I'm assuming you have to get all of the characters. Well, well, maybe not because I'm pretty sure I have all the characters somewhere, don't I? I have them at Walled City. So I don't have the walled city one. So maybe that's not the way you get the badge. How the heck do you get the badges? Maybe I'll go back to Numek. After I defeat this enemy, I'm gonna go back to Numek and see like, maybe if there's something there that I need to do. Maybe it's the time trials. And whenever the time trials open in a specific area, you have to do it. I don't really know. How do you get the badges? I'm gonna ask them. How do you get the badges? I'm gonna see if what this, oh, Mr. Oof. Hey, sir. How do you get the badges? Maybe he'll tell me. I don't really know. But in the description, it doesn't actually say. So we're just going to have to figure it out ourselves. All right. Taddy is almost dead. Please tell me it's going to give me a lot of yen. I'm at 75 million. If it doesn't give me even close to 500, then I'm going to have to do a lot of purchasing, aka just pay to win. <laughs> oh, God, that's nothing. That is yikes. All right. Yeah, we're going to have to just buy for now. We don't have time to do these time trials. I mean, technically we do, but like, I don't know. I've never actually done them yet. I'm a noob. Okay, there we go. We have enough to get through here. Let's just do this. Chimera Island. So here's the new island. I know I'm a little bit late to it, but at least we're here now. And there is Poopy. Hi, Poopy. Okay. <laughs> oh, Liam. So this is Leorio from the show. Leorio. These ants are everywhere. So inside the uh, Hunter Star, this is based off Hunter Hunter. We have Gone. Pretty sure that's Kilowa, the common. Um, I can't tell just from the image how uh, the rest of them, but let's go ahead and just start. Oh, wait, how much does it cost? How much does it cost? Oh God, 7.5. Okay, we can buy a few of these. We already got a shiny. Hold the phone. Hold the phone. Oh, we got Pika. This is Kurapika. I believe that's how you say it, all right? Karapika? Um, but Pika is insanely good. So we could take off this Kenji and put a Pika on. Nice. And I think we did get a shiny that we might have accidentally deleted. I hope not. Um, let's take rare shiny delete off. And then, yeah, because I don't want to do that. Let's go ahead and auto open the rest. So it is auto deleting Gon, and it's auto deleting Kilowa, because those are the commons. And then that rare and epic. Who's the rare again? I actually can't remember who that is. And again, I haven't seen the Chimera Ant arc, so like I might not know who some of these are. Oh, it's deleting, so I can't even see. It's deleting that rare, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, we'll just go ahead and keep on opening for now. Oh, I don't have enough. I don't have enough more money. But 
I can buy 900 million yen now. So now we're good to go. I really want to get this thing. I hope that I don't have a mythical pity that takes 10,000 stars this time. Because last time to get the mythical, it took forever. I really just want to have some early luck. That would be amazing. But the models look really good. Oh, somebody just got a gold art. But if you guys know how to get the badges in this game, definitely let me know in the comment section below. I'm going to try and get the badges and see what it does. But I oh, it increases the yen earned, which is really, really good. Like, this is kind of like what Pet Simulator 2 did, if you guys remember, where you basically just do things in the game and you unlock these passive boosts that are permanent that really help you. Like, basically just playing the game for five hours you end up getting like luck boosts. And then if you play the game for 10 hours, you get luck boosts. So basically the game just wants you to AFK or stay in the game. Oh, that was a shiny Killua, but I didn't get it because I deleted it. That's kind of sad, but it's fine. We can keep opening. So it's taking us a lot to, it's like spending like 25 million or something. How much is it spending? Yeah, like maybe close to 25 million. I got the legendary. Dude, oh my gosh. I can't, why, why can't I remember his name right now? Why can't I remember his name? Hisaka. I'm sorry, but I, I literally could not remember his name for a second. I feel like an idiot, but it's Hisaka. So Hisaka, the clown man, <laughs> 390k. That's the legendary without any fusion. That is pretty dang OP. These white reapers are really good. Big man's really good. And this Pika is actually not as good as this Karapika right here. Dang, I got some really good ones now. All right, so my team is looking pretty dang solid. I'm gonna keep it for now. I'm not gonna delete anything, but look at my team. It's mostly Hunter Hunter. As Well, actually not mostly. It's only two of them. I got Clown and Pika, and then I have Big Man from the One Piece Robux star, and then White Reaper from this ghoul area. So let's keep going. We already got the legend, which is amazing. Now I go for the mythical pity, right? Wait, the legendary pity is still happening, I think. Do I have to open 500 first? Oh, I'm still getting a legend. What about the mythical pity, bro? What about the mythical pity? No! Well, I'm assuming I'm going to have to just keep on opening past 500 to get that mythical pity. I'm hoping... Oh, I got a boost. I did get a boost. What did I get? What did I get? I think I unlocked the boost, right? Claimed, claimed. Oh, inventory. Nice. Let's claim that one. Not really close to anything else. I wish I could get all the luck boosts. I got luck one and luck two. So that is helping a lot. Luck three and luck four are ridiculous. I'm not even close, 25 hours. Those I'm not gonna get by this episode. But if I could get all of these badges and figure that out, I would be down. I don't know how to collect the badges. All I know is I'm gonna go ahead and keep on auto opening for a bit. If I don't get this thing right away, I'm gonna go ahead and just check out the other areas and see maybe how you get these badges. Maybe you have to defeat certain bosses there or something like that. So let's go ahead and keep on opening. I'll see you guys in a sec. Let's get this. Okay, sorry that clip cut off weird, but my life has never been easier. Guys, the last episode of us trying to get the mythical in this game literally took like 10 hours. I'm not even kidding. And already, I've barely opened any, probably a hundred or a little bit more. A hundred or a little bit more. And I've already gotten the mythical. That's all it took. I am so excited for that. So we got ourselves this mythical 0.037. We also just got something in here. What did, what did we unlock? What other boosts? Did I miss it? I unlocked another boost, damage. That's big. We got a damage boost. So we have the mythical, this is Netero, I believe. Isn't this, is this Netero, the head of the exam committee? I think that's who it is. Please don't yell at me, but I'm pretty sure this is Netero. I had to look his, look, look his name up because I forgot what his name was, but yeah, he's like the head of the exam commission thing where I don't want to spoil anything, but yeah. And we got a shiny legendary. These are insane pulls we got here. I'm probably gonna have to, I'm gonna have to take off Pika because Karapika is not that good. Big man, honestly, he might be better than these guys fused like eventually, but I'm not sure. But for now, the white reaper has more potential than regular clown once he's fused more. And then Buddha has insane potential and then the shiny clown. So I'm gonna equip that and I'm gonna equip Buddha. This is my five right now. Pretty sure that's my best five. Even though this clown is 390 and it's better than uh, these white reapers, this one has more potential to be higher once it's leveled up. And I think big man does too. So let's go ahead and fuse this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fuse this. Oh, and I got a shiny one of these, which again, that character, 
I can't recognize off the top of my head. I'm sorry if I'm a noob. D just who cares if I can't recognize a character, okay? <laughs> it's been a while since I've seen the show. But let's go ahead and use all these Pikas right here. And fuse. Now, we made our Buddha one million. Our Buddha is one million. That is the best character that I've gotten easily. And that is a mythical. We have our next mythical at 650. This one's level 86, by the way. You can go to level 101. But um, shiny clown right here can be insane. I'm actually gonna fuse a little bit to make this white reaper a little bit better because I feel like the white reaper has, has good potential. So let's take these Sukazas. I'm gonna have to like open a lot and and not uh not remove, not auto-delete some characters so that I can just get a lot to fuse with. Because it's it's better to fuse with the newest characters. They're they make for better fusions, you know what I mean? But I just fused uh this white reaper and I got him to 470. So my lowest one right now is 230. It's big man. Let me fuse a little bit for big man. Again, these characters are not anything crazy, so like they won't give me that much fusion. I'm pretty sure the better characters would be just to get like Gone and Kilua, like all these commons, like not delete them and then fuse them. I, I think that would be the better move. So I'm gonna like open up that fusion thing. I got a shiny sleepy right there. Let's just get rid of some of these so that we can make some room. Here's all these. All these old commons that are nothing anymore. All of these that are locked. I don't really know why they're locked. I think it's because they're Robux pets, but I don't really want them. Yeah, all of these are basically useless. All of these like older older uh, fighters, just because they're so far back. So I'm gonna try and just remove all of them. There we go. Okay, I got to the bottom of it. So there we go. I got to the bottom of it. I made a lot of room and we made Big Man up to 330. So he's still not better than Clown, but at 77. If he was 82, he'd probably be better than a regular Clown. If I'm wrong about that, let me know. But I think I think Big Man has more potential once he's he's fused a little bit more. But plane, this shiny plane is actually insanely good. I want to go ahead and I really want to get Buddha up even higher. But the fact that I got him to 1 million is just crazy. So this is my current pet team or fighter team right now. We got what we wanted. The mythical out of this new crate, this new star. I'm so happy. And then there is the shiny clown with that aura. That looks insanely cool. I like that a lot. So let's do a little bit more exploring. Hi, Liam. Um, okay, we gotta fight crazy ants in order to, in order to actually like complete these quests, we gotta fight these crazy ants. So I'm just gonna sick my guys on that one right there and they're gonna do the job and I'm gonna walk away. And uh, we'll come back and pick you guys up in a little bit, okay? You guys, you guys just do your thing over there. Oh, did they already kill him? No, they didn't. Oh, maybe there's like a distance thing, like you can't leave them. Whatever, well, we'll come back. I wanna explore the map a little bit, make sure there's no secrets that I'm missing out on because there's a badge at each area now, and I'm wondering how you get it. There's a poopy right here, and then there is the king right here, which again, I haven't seen this far in the anime, so I don't actually, I recognize that character from like spoilers that I've seen, but I don't actually know what it's called, so please don't judge me. Um, but I don't know where the secret badge is. I don't know how you get it. Maybe it's from fighting the king. I don't actually know. So if you guys know how to get the badges, definitely let me know. I'm gonna go to the beginning area because maybe we could figure out how to get the first few badges easier. Like, let's say I go to the beginning area and I fight that boss, like the secret boss or the or the final boss. Do you get the badge then? I don't really know. We could test it easier on the beginning area because those bosses are a lot easier. So I'm gonna go head over to the first area in the game. Let's see if we can figure this out. So I'm at Numek and I might as well grab some more quests because maybe, maybe that's even what you uh, need to do. Maybe you need to beat all the quests. Oh, here's the time trial in this area. But maybe you just need to beat all the quests. Maybe, maybe that's... Maybe that's what you do. I, I don't really know. I'm gonna go ahead and click on all these. Oh my gosh, I'm one-shotting literally everything. That's crazy. I mean, obviously these are the easiest characters, but the fact that they're so easy, even this boss is probably one-shot. <laughs> um, okay, so yeah, no quest badge or, or no badge or anything. So maybe it is from completing all the quests or maybe it's just the time trial. I honestly have no idea. If you guys got the, the badge, in an area, definitely let me know. I'm gonna fight all of these forces. Wait, where's force twos? I gotta fight force twos in order to get this upgraded a bit. This is force one, force one. So once I fight a few more force twos, I can get another quest. Finish your quest before getting a new one. Okay, I'll finish it, I'll finish it, dang. Where's quest two though, or where's force two? I don't know. 
Uh, not this guy. Oh, here they are. Here you little boogers are. Let's fight all these guys. Don't steal my force too, brother. All right. We have seven out of 15. So once we complete this one, maybe it'll get us closer. I don't know. The last quest. I have to take on Leader Gon or Gan. I don't know. I've never seen the show. Um, <laughs> we have to figure out if this is the final quest. I don't know if it is. Easy. Oh, I have to feed him, defeat him five times. But then this could potentially be the last quest. Why is there a boat out there? There's a boat out there. Can I go out there? Oh, you could see all the different areas. Interesting. Wait, what's that area? That snow area. I don't actually know what that is. And that boat. What the heck is that boat, bro? That's not part of one of the areas, is it? I don't know what that is. Anyways, let's just fight this guy. Okay, wait. What did I get? <clears throat> what did I get? So I finished everything. So I got a badge. Okay, so all you do to get the badges is you have to complete all of the quests in that area, which is pretty easy. And then you get a yen bonus. So I can get a bunch of yen earned bonuses and that'll help a lot when earning from the time trial by just completing all of the badges. So I highly recommend you get those AFK luck ones. You get those yen boosters. The in inventory is not too crazy. The extra star is really big. But yeah, that's basically it for this episode, guys. We got literally all the best stuff. We made it to Chimera Island and we figured out how to get badges, which is great. Thanks for commenting about it. I, I know you guys probably already commented and let me know. This is going to take forever. 30 crazy ants. That's going to take a while. These badges are going to take a while, but we're going to get them regardless. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, smash that like button. Subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys next time because I post two videos every single day. Again, I'm sorry about the tapping gods, drama, and weirdness. I'll have like a main video basically clearing that up and telling you guys more info. But for now, just hang tight and we'll do our best. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Watch another video while you're at it and bye!